Okay. First off, remove the magazine. Remove the chamber check. Nothing in there. I'm going to do a finger sweep. But, uh, chamber check. Freeze off the trigger. Um, this is how you move a stuck casing from a firearm. Obviously, I'm going to be able to chamber check it if you have a stuck casing in there because it's going to be stuck. <laughs> won't be able to move it. You can't move it. You try pushing it on a table. You try pulling on it really hard and it just won't come out. This is how you do it. You grab it by the rear serrations, the rear serrations of the side. Get your fingers out of the way of the ejection part, just right there. Take a view of that. Tight enough that you can see the whites in your fingers. Nice and tight. You want it as tight as you can possibly get it. When you get it, point in a safe direction. Finger away from the trigger, obviously. And nothing you want to destroy. And you're just going to come at it nice and straight. Get some velocity behind it. Just going to give it a good pop, like that. And that should remove the stuck casing. It's worked for me about four or five times now. I use reloads, and sometimes if you reload them too many times, they can uh, expand but not contract back. Like they're supposed to get stuck in your chamber, but that's how you remove it. Just like that. Just a quick pop. Just pop right out.